We're making a keto lasagna using keto pasta sheets. Let's go. Quite a few people have questioned whether my pasta sheet recipe can be used in a lasagna. So in this video I will share with you a simple but delicious keto lasagna, oven temperatures and times, how many pasta sheets to make for six, and of course whether the pasta sheet will actually work in a lasagna. Hi I'm Mel and welcome to my channel. If you are new here please do take a look around at our other recipes and if you love what you see subscribe and hit the notification bell so you know when I post a new recipe. You will of course need the recipe to make a pasta sheet and I will mention it in the video. A link will appear in the corner and you'll be able to click on it. If for some reason the link doesn't appear it's pinned at the top of my channel home page or you can also look for it in the keto pasta playlist. Let's get into the recipe now. Add 200 grams of smooth ricotta cheese that's whole milk into a bowl. Then 50 grams of grated parmesan cheese. 45 grams or three tablespoons of heavy cream. One egg. Some people don't season their white sauce but I like to so I'm adding a sprinkle of salt. Pepper. Dried oregano. And basil or Italian herbs and mix until combined. When it's ready, set that aside. Over a medium to high heat, add 500 grams of Italian sausage meat or ground beef to a skillet or pan, and we're gonna saute that, break up the meat, and let it cook for five minutes until the meat has browned. Do note in this recipe, we're not using any vegetables, and the reason is we wanna keep the carb count down. Now we're gonna season the sauce. So add a teaspoon of salt, pepper, oregano, basil or Italian seasoning and I'm adding a tablespoon of garlic powder because I love garlic powder. And then add 350 grams of marinara sauce or any tomato cooking sauce that you might have and try to get the low carb one. Give it a stir, switch off the heat and your red sauce is ready. Prepare a 2.0 pasta sheet and there's a link in the top right hand corner appearing now. Just going to trim off the edges. If you want you can cut your pasta sheet to measure your casserole dish. And then I'm going to cut it into fours. Add about two tablespoons to the base of your casserole dish and just spread it out to coat the bottom. For every layer of pasta you'll need about one sheet. Add a layer of your red sauce and spread it. And now your white sauce and spread that as well. This is 100 grams of cheese and I've measured out a total of 200 grams for the entire dish pasta sheet. Add another layer of red sauce and spread that and the remainder of my white sauce just spreading that. Spread 100 grams of mozzarella cheese grated. A sprinkle of pepper and some dried herbs Italian seasoning or basil, basil or oregano, oregano. Bake your lasagna at 350 degrees Fahrenheit or 175 degrees Celsius for 10 to 15 minutes depending on how crispy you like your cheese. I hope you can see that the keto pasta holds its shape really well. It's easy to cut into and some people are saying it's the best keto pasta that they've had. So I hope you found this video useful and you have all the information you need to make a delicious keto lasagna using a pasta sheet. Thank you so much for watching. Stay safe and be well.